City of Spartanburg wants to place cameras around the city to catch speeders. But officials say in order to do that, changes need to be made to state law. Our Colin Riviello explains how city officials conducted their own experiment and what they found. The city placed mock speed cameras on a couple of roads like South Pine Street, where the speed limit is 55 miles per hour. It found 30 of the almost 200 drivers recorded were speeding at least 10 miles over the limit. We want to do anything we can to make the street safer. And so, you know, with this and other things, we're just trying to look at possibilities. Possibilities that have so far been unrealistic. Right now, South Carolina doesn't have the uh, opportunity to actually be able to issue citations because of uh, state legislation. According to the current laws, a uniform traffic citation alleging the violation of a local ordinance or the traffic laws relating to speeding may not be issued based in whole or in part upon photographic evidence. That's because of issues that occurred in the past with different technologies. Why aren't there speed cameras in the Issues like side? privacy concerns that Bill Tent, a subject matter expert hired by Spartanburg, says were fixed through innovation. According to Tent, Spartanburg County saw more than 10,000 collisions in 2022, leading to 58 deaths. New legislation needs to be passed that works in favor of all the communities that uh, exist out there so that you can do speed enforcement. According to the city, a study conducted last year shows speed cameras can make Spartanburg's roads safer. So far, the data has shown us that there's potential for you know, safety increases. It's used as a deterrent to slow people down and as a reminder to help people to be mindful of safety rules. So fingers crossed, we're hoping that, you know, this could be something potential for us. The city says it plans to pursue changes to the state's laws sometime next year. In Spartanburg, Colin Riviello, 7 News. And the city plans to present the package as part of a larger coalition that includes other cities and counties like Columbia and Greenville County.